everyone and happy Wednesday. So today we are going over to Ross to do a little shopping spray. We did this recently with TJ Maxx and I haven't been to Ross in over, probably over a year I think. So I wanna go, I wanna see what they have and I wanna get a whole bunch of new goodies. It's like the cheaper version of TJ Maxx. Just when you didn't think you could get any cheaper, you go to Ross and it's a little bit cheaper there. Sometimes Ross's are super picked over though and there's not a lot left. That's why I haven't been there in over a year. I've just been hitting up TJ Maxx. But today Day, I thought I would give them another try and go check it out with their clothes, beauty products, and home goods and see what we can get. So if you guys want to go on this journey with me, well then just keep watching. Also, I think Ty and Aaron are going to be coming with us. So it's just going to be a whole family adventure and then we're going to come home and I'll show you all the goodies I got. But first, I'm going to take you to Ross with me. Subscribe. We are arriving at Ross. I've never been to this Ross before. It looks kind of small. Erin tells me it's big. She yeah. says it's a good one. So we're gonna try it out. It better not be picked over. I'm just kidding. A spotted Converse. Erin's about to get some Converse. That's not your size. No. It is a little empty, a little bare. Look at the shelves. <laughs> Ooh, all the shoes. Um, they do have a couple of sandals, but I don't really I don't need, need sandals. Them. Uh oh, we may have just found a shoe. <laughs> That's like exactly what we're wearing size. right now. Ooh la la, we are in the beauty department. You guys know I love it here. Looking at a couple different items. We have makeup, 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 which doesn't look that picked over. We have lots of hair care, lots of hair clips and more makeup. I'm in the purse section and I just found this Adidas bag and it was originally 30 bucks. It's for $15.99 and I want it. I love a mini book bag and I feel like I can take this to the beach and get it sandy or wet and it won't mess up. Guys, I love wearing um, shoes like this whenever I'm doing yard work or I can really mess up and not take care of. So I think I'm gonna get them just to wear on the house. All right, the home decor section is a little bit picked over, but I did find a couple of gems here. You guys know I would do that. I found these picture frames. I love the light color wood, and they come with the, uh, what do you call this? My brain is freezing. I don't know, it's like the mat that goes in the background for $7.99, so I'm buying two, they're matching. They look really nice. And it's hard to find picture frames that come with that border in them, and I really think it gives it a more expensive look. So you can hang these or set them up. Someone please tell me why I find a basket everywhere I go. But this one is $16.99 and I bought an identical one to it at West Elm for... I can't remember how much, but I'll put it on the screen. These are cool. You like leggings. I don't think they're your size though. He's a worker outer. Worker router. Oh, Aaron just found so many clothes. You Should I show them? Yeah, show them what you found. First of all... Let me show you all the shirts that I found over here. Uh -oh. She found so many shirts. Uh -oh. This will be her part of the haul. Yes. So cute. Love the flowers. Laura says it's too big, but I'm gonna make it fit. This part looks kind of big for Erin, but she uh, wants to make it work. I'm gonna make it work. Okay. This is just plain, cute. Plain That's green one? Yeah. That's cute. Cute. Uh, uh, uh. Sorry, cotton candy. This, I can make this work. I don't like this. I can make it work. Okay. And, and, and then I got some shorts. And, yep, some night night shorts. Night night shorts. Good girl. <laughs> girl, we got, we got shorts hanging everywhere. We, we're a mess. <laughs> we are a mess. I got this. We'll talk about this later though. All right, I would say we had a very successful trip at Ross. <gasps> Probably one of my most successful trips. They have the aesthetic, what is this water? <laughs> From that. Tumblr, I'm 2014. So That's the, probably what year. The static. That's water? The static, yes. How is that water? Oh, the water beverage. Okay, we're getting that. No. We're trying it. It's yes, for we the are. aesthetic, Ew. you know that Tumblr grunge. Guys, I am back from Ross and I'm gonna show you everything that I got. So be prepared because we went, we all three went a little overboard. But let me just dive right in and get started oh my gosh so to start with i got these sneakers how freaking cute are are you kidding me oh my god they're so cute so i got them for 29.99 they are the brand champion and they just look like this and i think they are so cute i live so i picked these up at ross of course where's the other one did i only get one oh, thank god 
some action. <laughs> I got one shoe. I don't have really wide feet, but I also don't have really narrow feet. So whenever I see a shoe is a little bit wider at the top, I just know it's gonna be comfort. Like Air Force Ones are really wide. So they're like perfect for me. They're so comfortable. But any sneaker that's like super narrow at the top, I cannot wear. They hurt my feet so bad. So these were really wide, super cheeky deaky. So I was like, perfection. And then I got them. I want it. I got it. <laughs> okay, you guys are really gonna scream when you see what I got next. I did not know that Ross sold Uggs, and me and Aaron found this pair of really popular Ugg slippers in black. They are the Ugg name brand. They look like this. They're so cute. Aaron just bought a pair of these for $100 off of Amazon. However, she got the really cute pastel color that just dropped, um, but they look like this. And I have these in pink, except for they have like the three layers, not the two layers. Kind of hard to see this one, put my hand through it. But these are precious and, and they were $27. $27. $27, guys. Aaron just bought these for a hundred bucks. Like, I can't believe it. When I saw them, I was like, is this real? And it was, and they were mine and Aaron's size, so we can share these. Um, and I'm just so excited about them. Really good find at... The next item I got I thought was so cute. I kind of showed you guys in the store. But this is like a mini book bag from Adidas. It looks like this. This is perfect to take to the beach or just any little adventure hiking that I go on. And I don't want to carry like some nice expensive book bag. But this one's so fresh. It's just mini and it has little pockets on the inside. I got it for $15.99. I think that that's a really good deal. It has adjustable straps. And I was saying in the store I like that it's like this material. So that way um, you can wipe it off if it gets dirty. It's no big deal. No big deal, darling. But this is one of my favorite finds as well. I've been looking for a little mini book bag. I have big ones and I have expensive ones. But I just wanted a small cheap one <laughs> and i found it the next item we got is this massive speaker because at our office we listen to music all the time and we used our speaker from our house i'm gonna open it up and see what it looks like but we used our speaker from our house little mobile speaker and we want it back <laughs> so we can use it at home so we just bought one for the office this is by the brand tech two tech two it just says tube on it i don't know this is one of Tyler's finds. It was $22, I believe. $22.99. This is the biggest speaker ever. It's huge. It just says Tech 2. It looks like this. Well, all right. It says it's a Bluetooth speaker, and then it has a little chargey cord. So this looks pretty interesting. I think it's a pretty good buy. And for, uh, oh, here's all the dials. But for the size of it, I think $22 bucks is pretty good. Guys, I bought a third pair of shoes. I went really shoe happy. Right whenever I got there in the shoe section, I was like, wow, this is like picked over. There's no point in looking here. And then I just started digging and I was like, oh my God, I'm just buying all this good stuff. So basically I got these bright turquoise. I think the color's kind of cute, but I got these um, little sandals because I wanted a pair. So my house is hardwood and I will wear the house shoes around, but I wanted a pair that I could wear outside and get dirty and just like not care about. Do you know what I mean? So these were $4.99. <laughs> so if they get ruined or muddy or messy, gardening, going on a walk, working at the office, doing whatever, I won't be upset about it. So that's like specifically why I bought these to, um, you know, bring in the groceries, check the mail, garden, work. I don't know. I'll probably end up wearing them every day and like wear them out, but they're cute. They're also like that foamy material. So they're really lightweight and I won't mind if they get dirty. Cause you can also wipe them off. The next that you guys know I love a basket. So I kind of want to set this like like set it up on a shelf in my home, this basket, or you could use it in the kitchen, like a bread basket. But guys, this basket was $7.99, and if you bought this from a nice home store, it would cost so much money. Trust me, I've done it before, and full regrets, because it's like nonsense. And honestly, since like Home Goods and TJ Maxx and Ross and all have opened back up, I've kind of quit shopping at the expensive home stores online, and I find all my goodies there for $7.99. Like, are you crazy? Like. Oh my God, this is so cute. It looks like the little boho vibes that I'm doing in my home. And they actually had like a lot of stuff there that were kind of that vibe. So with that being said, I like the light wood coloring. It's just like kind of the flow of my home. My home going really natural, less like designery. I want it just to feel homey, but very chic and beautiful at the same time. So these are the colors I'm going with. And I found two matching picture frames. 
as I was telling you in the store, they came with the frame, the outline frame. And these are five by sevens and I got them for $7.99 each. So I have some shelves in my main living room over there where we hang out all the time and they need little pieces like this to fill the shelves because I'm redoing the decor, like I just said. <laughs> and I thought these were just like absolutely perfect. Now I just have to find pictures. I'm so bad about buying picture frames and not putting pictures in them. Found these really pretty dish cloths for $4.99 and look how many you get. I need some new ones. Let's open them up and have a look. You know, you gotta renew the dishcloths every now and again. I've had mine for like three or four years. Probably should have renewed them a long time ago, but they get kind of gunky and really stained. Oh, I like these so much because they have the bath cloth fill on the other side. These are gonna be so good. Oh, I didn't even know they had that. That makes them even better. And I like the coloring of them. So yeah, get a whole pack of them. And they all have like the terry cloth, but one side is like, cotton and the other side it's like a towel oh my gosh you just get so many that was a good deal for $4.99 that's why i never buy dishcloths at target or anywhere i always go to tj maxx or ross because they're like the dishcloth queens okay i saw this like drink recipe that i wanted to try out on tiktok and you have to have cotton candy to make it and so i was like when am i gonna get cotton candy like i don't think the grocery store has it so then I was like, maybe I'll just order some on Amazon. And I was like, that's so dumb. I have to order cotton candy. And then oh, they had big buckets of it for $3.99. Oh my gosh. So I was like, you know what? And then as soon as I put it in my cart, Aaron and Ty were like, why are you buying cotton candy? I knew they were going to ask me, but just know I have like a genius plan with a cotton candy. By the way, uh, we're going to do the clothing haul that, of the clothes that I bought. I didn't get a ton of clothes, but I bought some. And I'll try them on for you at the end so just hang with me darling hang with me next thing i bought is bubble gum i love bubble gum it's so bad for my teeth to chew on but this is actually the double bubble brand which is one of my favorites i love big gum balls i always have like i restrict myself from buying them a lot of times but then i saw them there and they were just looking at me and they just said laura buy me and so i was like okay fine i'll buy you and then i bought them <laughs> So here they are. Uh, I love these. I'll put these in my pantry and I'll probably chew all of them. I always do this to myself. I why don't you buy bungee cords? Because all my other ones are dry rotted. He has dry rotted bungee cords. So he bought a massive container for only $9.99. Because you never know when you might need bungee cords. Aaron bought a bunch of tank tops, which I showed you guys in the store. So I will just bypass it, but I mean like $4.99, like so affordable. So hot here, once July hits in California, it's like relatively nice. July, September, July, August, and September are like our hottest months and it gets up to 100 degrees. <laughs> and like you can't go outside because it will literally hurt your body and the weather's just crazy. It's so hot. Um, Aaron shirt. Aaron shirt, Aaron shorts. Did you guys used to wear this Sophie brand all the time? I used to wear these all the time in high school. Oh my God. I used to freaking love these. They're so comfortable. Aaron shirt, Aaron shirt. Um, so I'm pretty excited about these. These were $14.99. They are, ooh, <laughs> they are Calvin Klein and they are like yoga leggings, but I will not be wearing these for yoga. I'll be wearing these for everyday life because girl, I love it. And they just say Calvin Klein performance on the back. And they are my favorite types of shorts to wear around the house. I love them. They're kind of like biker shorts, but they don't have the pad in the crotch area. Um, yeah, they're my favorite. They even have a little spot if you wanted to put your stuff in there. But these are really nice, really thick and stretchy feeling. So I will try these on for you. These are the shorts that I got. They are Calvin Klein. I almost got them in a medium and I'm glad I didn't because the um, small fits really well, but how cute are these? I just have my shirt rolled up so you guys can see, but these are perfect and they feel extremely comfortable. And I'm not gonna take them off. I'm probably just gonna wear them for the rest of the day because they're so comfortable and I like the way they look. Cute little outfit, huh? What do you guys think? And then lastly, I bought two Calvin Klein pieces, but this one was $19.99 and I thought, oh my gosh, it's a blue jean tie-dye button down i love button downs because i like to wear them open with stuff or i like to tie them around my waist whenever my shorts are a little too short so it covers my booty 
So I got this one because I thought it was really cute and it was a nice brand and I picked it up in the size medium. But mm, I think it's gonna be really cute on. I'll try it on for you guys so you can kind of see the vibe. Okay guys, so this is the cute little blue jean shirt that I got from Calvin Klein. Or it's by Calvin Klein. I got it at Ross. Do you guys see how cute it is? It's just like worn open and like super casual. You could also wear this open with a little black dress or something and dress it up a little bit. Um, or you could just tie it around your waist. Like I might do that too. But I love pieces like this. I think it looks fabulous. And I got it for such a good deal. If I would have got this full price, does it say? $69 is what I would have paid for it. So 70 bucks with tax. And I got it for $19.99. Super good deal. Wow, I feel like I went through everything really quickly. Oh, I got one more thing, which I need to show you because it's a dupe for something I already had. So you're probably like, why did you buy it again? But I'll use it in my home. So let me show you. Okay, so I got this basket here for $16.99. It looks awfully similar to this basket here. Don't you guys think they kind of look the same? Hmm, what you think about that? However, they are different brands. This is the brand. This one, okay. And this one I got at West Elm. And I'm gonna put on the screen how much I paid for this one. But remember, I paid only $16.99 for the same basket at Ross. This is insane, guys. So what I figure I could just put this in another room with a blanket in it because these two, I also have the square one. My cat's destroyed this one. I'm gonna put this probably upstairs in one of the rooms with some pillows and stuff in it. I always find a basket everywhere I go, but I'm pretty freaking excited about this find because it, it, my friends, it's a dupe. It's a dupe, baby. All right, guys, that is it for this video. That's everything I got at Ross. I feel like I got a ton of really good deals when I walked in there. I was super hesitant because it was super picked over, but. I just dove right in and at Ross you just gotta dig a little. That's just part of the shopping experience and you find all the goodies and gold. So that's what I did. It was a super fun day. I haven't been there in like over a year so I'll definitely be going back specifically to that Ross. I'll be going back for more. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for being here and watching. Be sure and hit the subscribe button before you leave and turn your notifications on so you can be the first to watch. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!